I love sis. And sis loves me. Good morning, guys. So we decided to do something different this morning, which was to have coffee before the ride. Good morning. Good morning. Where are you? It was exactly like Melbourne. This is how the ride started. In a cafe, you roll up a quick cup, then you just go for the rolls through. Long ride in a month, be kind. What are you gonna hurt today, man? Easy, easy. Don't, don't no, 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 as, as long as you say easy, right? I just need to like keep up. I'm not here to search okay. today. No, worry, be easy. Trust me. Oh, fuck, bro. I'm scared. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I thought I fixed my favorite. Yeah, I put it on this morning, it was kind of funny sound. Then you get here. Not bad, lah. Not bad. Not bad, lah. We are up around the time. So this is quite a smart cup design. <laughs> you know why? It has to be cool enough for you to pick it up. Uh. Then you won't burn your lips. Thanks, man. Thank you. So we went to this place called State of Affairs. They open at 6 a.m. on Saturdays and Sundays. I think it's quite a good idea. I think we can do it every weekend. Yeah. Like we meet at 6 a.m. Yeah. at a cafe. I think it's a good shot in the morning. Yeah. And the good thing I like about the place is that we can be late because we're supposed to meet at 6 o'clock and then we can come in at 6.20. You want to tell the viewers about the route for today? Sure. So today we're starting at Long House along the uh, Upper Thompson Road, heading towards Yishun Dam, and then round Salita, straight to Tampanese, and then Coastal Route. Pretty short ride today, I think. Ian probably disagrees. It's as long as I am suffering. We made a promise to Ian, and we will keep it. Yep. Not a bad idea having pre ride coffee. Yeah, very nice. Start with some caffeine. So, you know, maybe we're a bit more awake. Right. Let people be late and not be angry. Yeah, you pretty much have a 30 minute buffer. <laughs> and then you can come at like 6 30 when you're supposed to meet at 6. And then you have the opportunity to make yeah, amends right there <laughs> by paying for the coffee. <laughs> the last guy pays for everybody's coffee. <laughs> and she has started that. Very incentivizing. Yeah. I know I'll lose a lot of money. I, had, I think I will lose even more. Yeah. <laughs> oh, the weather this morning is damn nice, man. My Wahoo says that it is 22 degrees. Yeah. Can't get any better than this, man. So 22 degrees, coffee in the morning. What more do you want? So you finally capitulated and got your Fiveros? Yeah, that's right. Um, it was actually a really good investment. It's only my second ride on the road. It's been a great instrument at telling me where I'm going too hard or I'm burning my mattress unknowingly. How long have you considered getting a power meter for? Well, I mean, it's as long as my friends had one. Hashtag no originality. Always wanted to get one after seeing my friends having it and seeing how measured their rides were. Was that what made you want to get a power meter? Yeah, definitely. Only after getting the power meter, I realized that some segments I just, just go out of control, purely because I'm feeling good. Any issues with transiting from Shimano to Luke? Not at all. In fact, I was I started out of Luke, then I went to Shimano, Singhai back to Luke again. So no issue. Although, like what uh, everyone else would recommend, perhaps don't use the red ones that Favero provides. Go get yourself a grey cleat. 
Would you recommend getting a power meter? Oh yeah, definitely, man. Especially if you feel like you know you're out of control, riding all over the place. Definitely, it's a, it's a good tool to have. change today we have decided to go by the main road instead of the park connector seems to be a lot less crowded these days on the main road saw a big group going into the park connector so maybe that's where everybody wants to check out pretty nice morning to be out weather looks really good Julian's really driving it on the front and we're all just sitting in and being quiet seems to be going quite well so far I think all those interval sessions on Zwift have helped a lot Hey, nice one, man. Are you thinking of getting a power meter? No. Right? Yeah. Look at how smooth it is. What? It's really just keep setting that range and then just keeping to it. So guys, if you're thinking of getting big and strong like Vincent, all you need is good jeans, good food, lots of sleep, and a power meter. Suggestions for breakfast? Oh, wow. Sorry, I really don't. I just had Max yesterday. <laughs> oh, we can go Amoy. Amoy just reopened. Yeah, that sounds like quite a good idea. Any other suggestions for breakfast? Where did he suggest? He suggested Amoy. Just not Hong Kong anyway, Okay, we can go somewhere else. Yeah. Vince uh, said he had McDonald's yesterday. So that's out. Let's not do McDonald's as well. Let's go to VCM. Okay, sounds, sounds good. good. Vincent hasn't been, so it would be good to show him. Yeah, nice time to bring him there. Yep. Nice place. Yep. Are you enjoying yourself so far? <laughs> uh, yeah, not too bad. Legs are hurting a bit. I don't know why everybody has so much power. Makes no sense to me. Like, what the fuck is going on? Do you need a face break? Sure. We can also take it easy now. Yes, please. Thank you. I can't. That's what we all say, like, you know, right? we're all liars on the bike. Can't trust a single word he says. <laughs> yeah, I can't, I can't. <laughs> going to eat BCM at uh, New Road. New place at oh. New Road. Alright, I love BCM. Yeah.
one month off the bike and we're still here. Pretty good. Yes. <laughs> so these are the famous noodles that we were talking about. Best shit ever. Come on, man. Twenty thousand dollars outside the cafe, and they're inside drinking coffee. Nowhere else. Nowhere else. Guys, where are we going for coffee? Equip or Maxi? Okay. Uh, end of my reserve club. Nothing left. Thank you for watching.